What's going on YouTube? It's Jay Scotty Sun back with another Pokemon YouTube video. In this video, I'm going to be opening up these three vintage Japanese booster packs. And I'm very excited for that. And I even have my good luck charm down here with me. Yeah, a little passed out buddy. Charlie, there you go. What's up, dude? All right, back to the video at hand. Let's see if I can plug the mic in, actually. There we go. All right, what should I start with first? I'm gonna go ahead and go with Fossil. Searching for the Dragonite. Would really like to see a Dragonite. And I got the sleeves and card savers already ready. Nice and soft here. Bring it to the back. All right, it's looking good. I'm not seeing any scratches there on the back. The center end looks good. Mr. Fuji to start it off. There we go. Mysterious Fossil. Krabby. Horsey. Grimer. Hominite. Kabuto and our hollow rare is Aerodactyl. Yep, that's a clean looking card. Really nice centering and I already checked the back on it. It's looking like a probable PSA 10. Unless I went with Beckett, then maybe a pristine 10. But we already know that I don't go with Beckett too much. I do have two orders with Beckett at this moment in time. But when I go to the app, I'm logged in to Beckett Grading Solutions, and they still say I have no orders with them, even though I placed them back in June. Here we are in February. All right. So I prefer PSA. As soon as they receive it, you know, they have a little barcode on the, I print out a barcode on the package and they scan it and they say, we got it. And it gives you a little peace of mind. And also back, uh, PSA is a little cheaper overall. So I have an opening, uh, the last few times I've opened up this uh, pack, there have been little, uh, I didn't mention it last time, but there have been uh, little minor imperfections with the bottom left-hand side, I believe it was that I failed to notice, but off off camera, I noticed it. So maybe I'll show you what I'm talking about, if these have it or not. In the last one, I'm, I referenced the reflection of the, uh, of the card being in the foil, and it actually was. You can pretty much see the card like a mirror Victory Bell. Got a lot of those actually. Poly Whirl. Let's get a little closer. Onyx. Rhyon. Seal. And Firo. And the centering's a little off, and there is a dent. There is a dent right there on the side. Maybe you can see it. Yeah, there's that dent right there. But the bottom left and the bottom right look good on it. But that dent and the centering would probably make it go down to an eight. Yeah, it's a bummer. Big old dent. Still a beautiful card. No print lines. Let me go over these other cards that I just opened. See if there are any of those imperfections that I was talking about on the last pack. Yeah, these don't seem to have it. That gives me confidence to open up another one of these. Cool. All right. And for the main event, could we pull a Charizard or a Venusaur? That's displayed in the back there. Loosen that up a bit. Yeah, and there's plenty of band cards in here to, to pull as well. This one has some scratches right there, you can see. Let's go ahead and pull a rare card from the front. It's quite off-centered, actually. And there's actually a dent right there in the card. But we'll go ahead and put that in the back. Very off-centered, so whatever card that is, it's not looking great for for grading. 
Haunta, Magikarp, Pidgey, Nidorina, Coughing, Tangla. Oh, it's a Fero. Sorry, a Mol Moltres. I had the, the Fero right here in my mind, but they both look like, you know, chicken birds. Darn, this Fero is off centered. That's a bummer. That centering and what could be considered a dent in the card will definitely ding it. But not, not a bad pull from this, uh, this pack, I would say. One of the better pulls. Let's get the third one up and display them all. I like to get them really good and tucked in there. So yeah, these are our flying Pokemon that we just pulled from these three packs. As always, let me know what you guys think about this. Um, some swirls up in there somewhere. What looks to be a swirl forming down there. There's a swirl right there. Yeah, they look pretty nice actually when they're in here. But yeah, no 10, maybe a 10 here, but Maybe a, a nine and an eight on this one because of the ding right there. Take care, y'all.